Okay, so now let's talk about the wind power. Wind power uses the wind energy to generate the electricity. So when the wind moves, the blades of the turbine moves and finally the turbine which is moving can generate the electricity. It is also free energy but needs to be in an area that has constant wind with enough velocity to warrant the placing of the windmill. Best used in particular site with a good steady supply of the wind. These are some of the new technologies which can be used at a very high level more than uh, 1000 meters above the ground surface where the wind speed is constant as well as very high. So these can also be used. Major distribution or the major uh, wind power plants installed in India are mainly or we are having the highest uh, wind power plant installed in Tamil Nadu which is having around 7200 megawatts of um, windmills are installed and then it comes to the uh, Gujarat where 3000 megawatts and then there are many more places where we have installed so many of uh, windmills next what are the advantages wind is also a free form wind is also free wind farms also it it does not need any kind of fuel it produces no waste or greenhouse gases the land beneath the windmill can be used for the farming for other things because in case of solar energy we can we cannot use the land so in this case the advantage is that we can use the land Wind farms can be a tourist attraction also, a good method of supply of energy to remote areas. And what are the disadvantages? First disadvantage is the unpredictable wind because the wind is not always uh, same. So suitable areas for wind farms are often near the coast, uh, coastal regions where the land is also expensive. It is also noisy and can be can interfere with the migration pattern of the birds. So what is hydropower plant? Power is generated by harnessing the energy of falling water. 